Live here. Welcome to yeah. um, TBO20 Grand Finals. Um, today we're going to see Aaron against Lejovin in, uh, I believe, pretty um, good Grand Final. Both players fought their way up to finals. Uh, Juven is on winner's side here, while Aaron needs to win two sets because they come from loser's side. They just won their set against um, Double Cookies. And yeah, Double Cookies game was very close. They both played uh, some really close games and I'm with Shaz today. Hi Shaz. Hello. Um, yeah. I haven't followed, sorry, too closely the tournament. Of course, very excited to see Leovin and Aaron play together. Two great, two great uh, players. Um, Aaron, we have not seen so far uh, that much um, recently. Apart from the diamond bracket, quite recently, where they got seventh place. Yeah, and we are getting right into it. Both players started the game, and we're going to start on Thunder Point here. Both players with some pretty good opening, but Yuvin now has the problem that they are not able to place anything really impressive in turn two. They have to like go f uh, go use the combo part, I think. Ah, uh, sorry. Technical difficulties. On Discord you are sending the delayed version. Is there a way not to do that? I'm not streaming a delay. Oh. Yeah. I, I, yeah. I'm gonna try and connect to myself. Sorry. Yeah, uh, happens. Okay. Here we go. Um, yeah. Okay, we s we're seeing the... Uh, Nova turn two, Nova turn two play, and while that Aaron playing a pretty defensive, I think Octa Commander. Yeah, I, I believe it's Octa Commander. And even going with that incline could have gotten two special points there, mm -hmm. um, um, but did but not go for it. I think we might see uh, Lyovin struggle in the late game because they are using their Nova, which is a combo with the heavy edit, and same for Eclite, which combos with um, the jellies. So it'll be interesting to see what they can come up with on the fly to farm efficiently. Yeah, I completely agree with that. Uh, currently, I need to make you a bit louder. Currently, it just looks, I would say, very bad for Yuvin. Yes, uh, with that um, late game deficit, they don't have anything right now, they don't have a space advantage or that great of a special placement either, I just noticed. Yeah, and it, it's it's just looking perfectly for Eren. Eren having uh, that little jet spot there is... I'm not sure if Eren is like in the... Um, in that much of a point seat, is getting Oh, the it's a Clash Buster. So. Yeah. Oh yeah, I wasn't sure it was whether it was a clash blaster or a, a shot. Better shot. Yeah. Oh yeah, that. Yeah, looks like it's a clash blaster there. Uh, yeah, it's pretty much a clash. Yeah, blaster. Definitely, it's a clash. <laughs> Holy shit! Yeah. Okay. Yeah, you. Now Wait, you see kind I of see the an in There's a, a line marker spot to potentially, but, but probably not. Oh, you've been getting three, four special points with that. Coming back with specials, Aaron currently needs to get the little jot is in a 13 points advantage. And mm -hmm. after that turn, it's not looking like Given can place anything else. But I have to say it's very impressive um, that Given, despite having used already so many combo cards, still has uh, one great move that's late into the game. But I don't think they don't have right now any small cards to set up for, uh, you know, a very good special on the last two turns. So let's see what they can do. Yeah, and that was an impressive DJ Octavio, and that's even better. Yeah, DJ Octavio coming in clutch there is not going to give two special points, which is a problem for Yuvin right now. Yuvin needs to get two special points there to play. But one will be pieces. enough with a pass. So... Oh yeah, one would be enough there, yeah. That is right. But there's so Lilja really potentially on the way. Aaron kind of getting RNG'd with their setup, but when you have a setup that uses so many cards, it's bound to happen, so fair enough, I would say. Yeah, and 
human sees the opportunity and it's not using the card because they would give Aaron one special point and you don't want to give Aaron one special point there. Now it's fine because they probably got their little jet there. And mm -hmm. yeah, yes, but that's little jet will, give, will get them into the lead. Yeah, yeah, that's that's I think what they're aiming for and well, it's just doesn't set up anything great for the Sip Casper. It's looking very dire. Oh wait! Oh, they did not they gambled and they failed. Oh, okay, it's, it's fine because they would have free, they would have five special points, yeah. three special points, anyways. But now Yuvin needs to find a really good placement there because Aaron has Best such fortune. a gorgeous place. Yeah, but still, I think having a better placement is always better there. Yeah, okay, they would win um, if they just place it like that. I think it's gonna be way more than enough. Yeah, okay, yeah. It, it it will that's and that's about 27 or something yeah 28 27 yeah and yeah, that's impressive you even came back after such an interesting and i would say like bad opening that's i don't really know if it was if they ever were really down i was kind of surprised but maybe um, they were used to playing very much on the left side of the board contrarily to use uh, you know developing your your points around the corner to the right. Interesting game. Oh game yeah, next. okay. I know what you mean. Yeah, the thing is, I think they had like so many other turn two cards or turn three cards, but they did not get any of them. So that's what I mean with that. Yeah. Well, uh, that's the thing with the, the. I think it was Dynamo opener, right? From Aaron. Can't really yeah. take advantage of that. The passive uh, turn two. Oh yeah, that is that is true. You you're going defensive there, and wow, this hand is looking so good for you right now. Um, after that big man two, it will be impossible to gain that much space. Yeah, that is yeah, that is such a good opening there. Really looking good for you, Ben. Uh, unfortunate. Um, the, there won't be that much, that many ways to go off of the uh, captain, uh, big man too. Sorry, uh, to take advantage of this, of the weak leader. But oh yeah, I guess they ah, have I see the, a hero shot. Oh, it's gone. I guess they have the tri stringer too, which should be good. Oh yeah, that Tri Stringer is going to give them like so much space in the spawn. It's also kind of defensive, so if Aaron is not placed um, anything there, but oh, they will. I so pretty they much dislike there. that move because now it's all open for Yovin on the other side. I think. Yeah, that is um, true. The... Reflex, reflex. I think I think E Litter is very good there. Yeah. Okay. Really? Aaron is going aggressive as well, but. Yuvin is not having as much space, so it's looking very good for Yuvin there. Mm, because um, that these first two turns from Yuvin just control so much space. I mean, they don't control much space in terms of uh, amount of squares, right? But they have such control over it. It's gonna take so long to breach. Oh yeah, that is, that is true. And that's why it's so important to get like very, very, very good openers on this map. If you, I mean, if you like really but... get... Sorry. No, no, it's fine. But I've said that's why it's very important for your openers to control space on this map specifically. That's yeah. What I've said. Oh, okay. Yeah. Cards like I don't know. Uh, what I what are bad cards are in this map? Because they are they are really awesome. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. I I was not a fan of that uh, scoped leader. As the first card, for example, maybe they just got unlucky and had nothing better. So that's. Oh yeah, I agree. Um, I don't see any combos right now they can go for. The best seems to be the reflux plus uh, T tech. Yeah, that's. Oh, wow! He's getting that special point. It's even activating the special point. That's incredible. 
plus two points, wow, who has the easiest time specialing? Yeah, and what is that now? <laughs> if we can use the Trizuka there. Uh, yeah. Do they have another 312? Oh, yes, they do. I'm bad. Yeah, they do. Unfortunately, no small cards yet. That's gonna be yeah. this is very unfortunate. They hope. Uh, yeah, they, they do hope to get both of their small cards there. They still have Slosher and. Uh, yeah, and the T take, which both can really get some space. And the T take is still able to get two special points. So not maybe. Not getting it. Ah, uh, yeah, not getting it. And maybe they can play Skinali Eddie if they get it. Yeah. Or double special, huh? We don't know. Sorry. Yeah, needs to pass again. Aaron's getting two special points. Both are. Uh, equal with special points, and Aaron is only having one more point there. Oh, Aaron already select what to play next. You been oh, having a decent tentacle missile there. I did not get the slosher, by the way. Where's the slosher? Where's the tea tag? Oh, Aaron needs to pass there. Oh, gets the slosher, and I don't think they wanted the slosher there. Mm -hmm. Not gonna give them anything in terms of specials. That's that's this map in a nutshell. The, the board explodes so fast that instead of wanting your combo pieces, you want your smalls. Oh, and Aaron had the perfect special, but the perfect special is not going to help because of Yuvin still being in a point advantage and can still place the T take. The T take might be clutch here. Aaron. Oh, Aaron needs to get a special. Can't place the charger. That's gonna be a plus six victory, I think. Yeah. Job. Aaron just took that game. Uh, and that charger was so good there. Um, really gave them the points they need. So, yeah, that kind of was much disliked. I very much disliked how the position looks from the opening, but they really did manage to turn it around, arguably with a bit of luck from Jovins not getting so the small cards. Oh yeah. Okay. Oh, we're getting into the next game, and you've been getting both smalls in the first op in the opening hand, and yeah, that's a redraw. Yuvin is getting such a big, such a good hand there. Uh, Amazing. Big man. Once again, they are starting with Big Man. Are we gonna say once again a uh, Dynamo? No. No, it's Octa Commander, and now we see that Octa Commander is like. Ah, Octa Commander is not that much of a good opening here. I mean, Octa Commander is a follow up combo to um, the Dynamo start, so. Maybe a bit of wow. over committing to this combo. This opening, sorry. Yeah. And that defensive play from uh, Aaron really turned out good. Yuvin is forced. Ah, uh, Yuvin is thinking of, to play the to play the uh, Ultra Stamp so early again. Can also play the Jella Flirty at one special point. Uh, but problem now, oh, Aaron can get into the spawn. Yes, it will get breached. But that move also sets up the curling bomb. Wow! Yeah. Oh, that is true. I did not see that. Uh, they get that instantly. That's so good. Wow. Oh, like, yeah, but I think... back their luck stats right now. From the yeah, but I think going defensive now is... Uh, going a bit more... I would say aggressive is better there. Where would you play? Because here it's such a great setup, I can see. Yeah, no, I... I, I did not see that uh, combo with... Uh, the, the combo with this bladder, uh, with this blue, I did not see that, sorry, forgot that. Oh, I think oh. I would have personally played that Nova Splatter shot, why do you think they did not play it? Because they want to go aggressive, that's what they always do, and now we, oh, that's, okay, that auto bomb, uh, would have done it, but now, now we're just going. going to see a special, yeah, that's Yuvin. Oh, and that is such a good special there, can get everywhere in the spawn, even in the, on the, like, top left. Alright, I didn't see amazing. that it breaches diagonally. 
That's gonna be yeah. such a huge Look spike. At that. Even winning a small and push and the points advantage. Shelly and Donny there. Yeah, this is this is Tay with her at its finest. Such good board vision, like not just I think lower level players just tend to do, including myself, is just over focus on one aspect of the game, like comboing. But such good whole board vision. Not hear you. Oh, I did not talk. I did not talk. <laughs> I was quiet. Uh, Sorry. <laughs> I was checking the stream. <laughs> yeah. Happens. Uh, but yes, this aggressive play really turned out great. Oh, yeah. Uh, it did. Human is not sure what to play at the moment. Still has that heavy deck, uh, heavy edit. And is trying to get a weird curling more placement. Well, I'm trying to read the opens. Yeah, I'm not sure what the read is. <gasps> oh, is this? No, it's not. <gasps> the little chat read. No. <laughs> ah, yeah. Ah, yeah, that was that was a really good little chat. Now we can still play savvy edit, which I think they love heavy edit. Um, we talked about it. We talked about heavy edit, and uh, yeah, I think he really likes it. Mm hmm. This game again, um, not seeing its magnificent combo with uh, no splatter shots, but still getting a good chunk of points for Yuvin. Yeah, but we, Yuvin did not get the card they want. Um, they could go for a 50-50 here, but they okay, they refuse to. They just need their uh, their how is it called again? Uh, splat bomb to get to two specials now. But they did not get it, they get it last turn. It oh, is that's... unfortunate, but maybe there's a way to get uh, that special point activated, I'm not sure. Oh, I don't even think they need it. They could also just like pass and use TJ Octavio, I guess. Yeah. Very true. Or Eren oh. just <laughs> quit. I mean, also not. Okay. <laughs> and that's a 2-1 lead. So, we'll need to win two more games on our own side and then... One more set. Yeah, we're preparing to see the... Next game. And did my OBS crash? No, it did not. Okay, I was okay. shocked. Holy shit. I thought it crashed. Yeah, and you need to... You will only need to win one more game to get that tournament win and we're going to see river drift next and oh no he's running the wall <laughs> no way he's running the I'm wall sorry, I don't see it. oh yeah sorry, sorry. uh here no no Thanks. uh he's running the wall guys it's updated wall now with with kohotsuna yeah oh that's <laughs> so good he's running the wall there this is amazing for every for anyone that does not know what the wall in particular is, the wall is a strategy that Yuvin created at one of the most competitive tournaments ever called Golden Duel On, um, which also takes place tomorrow. It's not Golden Duel On, but it's like the newest event of Duel On. It's called Duel On Stage Selection, which basically is a uh, tournament in which only one map is played. Probably like side deck, if you know what that is. But you even use that tactic on River Drift to get, um, yeah, to win the tournament there. And it's, oh, it's looking so good for you there. Eren mm -hmm. needs to get something in. And Eren needs to get something, to get in there. And the difference is uh, during duel on um, Golden, the opponents did not know what was going on, but here they definitely do know and know that game and how it ended, so... <laughs> you can imagine how panicked Aaron is getting, seeing what happened Oh, yeah. The cards... There are two cards you even need. 
either uh, the burst bomb or this tent attack with the octo. Oh, they go for that one, and this is going to be so huge for them because they. Ah, uh, you need to yep. go finish the wall. I think. Maybe afraid of being late. To yeah, but now they're the special in with the wiper. And you even knows that. You even knows that I place wiper. Oh, but that wiper is going to kill. That wiper is not going to be enough, and it's going to reach. Ah. Uh. That's the breach, but no specials to be seen. Oh, thank you. <laughs> yeah, as I said, serious. you even should have placed Octopod. Yeah, or spin or turn the Octopod like around. That would have been better. Uh, yeah. That's sad. Um, Do you think there was no way for them to win at all right here? And like that game after that breach. No. Yeah. Okay. Definitely not. He even like he definitely lost. Okay. We're going back on Thunder Point. Third time and second time on Luvin Speak. Yeah, and we're seeing TJ Octavio again against a Dynamo Roller. Yeah, it's having the cold blooded shiver again. Uh like we had it last game. Mm -hmm. And that's a very interesting theoretical battle between the Octavio and Dynamo because the Dynamo defense wow. is um, relying on that only one space gap, while Octavio is relying on being a three space gap, but for quite a width, which forces slower plays. At least that's the idea. And that was a beautiful breach into the spawn of Eren. Even now with the perfect, with the perfect uh, game right now, even it's it's looking so good for even right now. Even can place the heavy edit combo later on. It's having so much space. Killed the combo from uh, Aaron there. Can, Aaron cannot really place anything in the spawning anymore. But but they might be afraid of uh, being behind on space still because of that top left corner which they seem very concerned about. Uh, could that turn the tides of the game in the end in favor of Aaron? Oh yeah, maybe. We're going to see. Yeah, Yuvin is thinking about how to place this bluesh. Uh, they definitely want to place it there because it's just better for them to have it there. But I don't know, do they have Sprinkler or T-Tech? They should have T-Tech at least. Mm, yes, I'm pretty certain they run T-Tech in many decks, so this one would not be surprising. I'm trying oh, to disrupt... Going for it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, disrupting the combo there. Incline with the jelly, but... We opt not to right now, because this area is of course higher priority. Oh yeah, because there is so much, there was so much space left. Oh, and now Yuvin gets that, gets that heavy edit. And this the combo should be beautiful. finalized uh, right when they get their first jelly. Yeah, Aaron going aggressive. Uh, disrupts huh? the combo. It blocks. This. Yeah. Oh, and I don't really think it's... Ah, uh, it's not... It's not bad for Yuvin though. Yuvin can still place the curling bomb. So it's it's fine for Yuvin, it's fine. Yes, and, and 14 points up, two special points. It's really not something you can neglect, right? Yeah. And that double pass is gonna just bring them one step closer to the win. Oh, I think they actually want to go for the 50-50. Yeah, they want to go for it. Oh no, they want to do it themselves. Yeah, makes sense. In case they lose the 50-50, but I think it's uh, it's fine to go special like in in the spawn. Yeah. Oh, that is also not not that oh. bad. Getting one special point. Wasn't that getting two special points? I think it was. Oh, n n I don't think so. Oh, that's. Oh wow, there are so many cool zip caster spots like that one. That's really good there. As well as that one. Uh, 
Yeah, it's not really confident with yeah, the Zipcaster. They don't want to use their Zipcaster too far because they don't have any great spots for uh, their... Don't... Okay. I was afraid yeah, they they of just them timing it. out. Okay, and now they hope the 55th and they <gasps> won the 55th. And that should be the tournament game. And that's the tournament uh, yes. win for you win. Yeah, and... <laughs> you win the just one TBO20. In a 3-2. Yeah, just like they do with all of their sets. Yeah, you win one on every Thunderpoint game, by the way. We see we saw Thunderpoint three times here. Uh, he loves Thunderpoint, I guess. But yeah. Yeah, Thunderpoint definitely one of the... Maybe what it would, people would consider the least RNG maps. Oh, yeah, Thunderpoint is like aggressive. Yeah, Thunderpoint is like either you can go aggressive or not and... Like, to go aggressive, you don't really need specific cards, you can just go aggressive. Mm -hmm. 